Hey guys. So, set this up here. Okay, so here is the big surprise. Our family has been saving up a lot and we have purchased some land. Ta -da! I know, I know, it doesn't look like much, but we decided to take a week to come down and do some clearing, get some logs out and have some family time because we've been stuck inside. So I'm sorry, I'm sweating up a dickens. It's actually not too bad out right now, but I just got done setting up a full on shelter. Hold on. Wave hi guys. Hi. He made a fire pit. My Jaden made a fire pit. And I got some seats. She helped with seats. And we That's set up our little shade. So it's like our little our little uh, home away from home. You gotta work the boys. With what you, got out here. you gotta work with what you got. Yep. Um, and I made a water bottle stand. The full goal out here is to become full time homesteaders. Uh, we won't be out here for at least a year, but we're gonna work towards that goal. So the boys right now are putting more permanent stakes uh, for our property lines and they're finding our third marker. We purchased about, just about five acres here and we are in the heart of Missouri. And it is so beautiful out here, so beautiful. Well, this area was old logging area um, our parcel across the way kind of around it's all logging area and so you can see like this whole area that's all logged but our property goes way back there and then goes way down there and you come across here and it goes way over there somewhere but it looks like this you can walk you around here doesn't look like much. Um, we're hoping to put our house somewhere right up over here. And then when we get to it, my mama's property will probably be over there somewhere. Cute little road. All that. I just heard my husband and his brother down there. I don't know what happened, but they just yelled. Hopefully it's nothing bad. <laughs> we'll go over here though. You see him over there? Did you find it? Really? Let's go see it. I like, I grabbed one, guys. All right, so we are going to try to get down to this area here. My husband found a little turtle on our property and he said he just saw a deer which we have deer tracks all throughout this land see the remnants of old logging around cute come on little tortoise hello friend oh he's so cute what do you have to say babe about what i don't know it's hot tell him what you just did i'm sweaty we marked, well, there's three property markers that we know of. Oh. I'm trying to find out if there's a fourth. I don't think there is, but we marked them with metal stakes. I don't see any more horse markers, but it's pretty much straight like this where I'm at. Oh, He's up there somewhere. There's an orange marker on that tree. Oh, there tree. he is. So okay. the loggers, when they were in here, they put orange tape all down the property line so we can tell where the property line is. So from the road up there, down here, to the other marker which is over there we own all that it's a nice little valley in here oh it's cute hey. down here great so a lot of logs to clean up 
but yeah, I think if we get the logs, the down trees, this is it will be pretty. A really gorgeous, gorgeous spot. It has a lot of potential. Yeah. The turtle must be turtle. All right, I'm going to show you how big our area is. So this is down the road. Um, if you head down this way, there is a circle drive that goes all along the waterfront there. The waterfront is just there. If you go down that way, the water is, you see that little inlet? The water's just right down there. Okay. You can see right here's our pool. This is our little marker that we did. So we own all that going back in there. All that in here. This is going up the road. I don't know if you can see him. Our car's right there. This is only the first little part of our property. So I'm gonna walk along the whole front of it so you can see how beautiful it is and how much work it's gonna be. <laughs> Here's a drive it looks like. They went up and did some of those branches going up there. Sounds like a car's coming up. We did find some blueberries on the property. We did find our wild onions. There's some other stuff. So here's a clearing here. I'm guessing we'd probably put something up there. Alright, so that's just where I went up. Okay, so this is the main area, main road. So if you go, this is where we just came from. So Indian Hills is down that way. There's another little small group down that way. And right up here is a church. We own all this. So where this car is, is going to be probably our drive. If you see the orange stake, right kind of in these trees, that's where the cabin we're thinking walk down here so you can see all the logging tore all this up there's a big old pile and it kind of dips down right right in here but there's a big meadow we own clear back to that clearing go over here got our power poles and we're thinking mama's cabin probably right over here Nice little spot. Can't really, pictures don't do this place justice at all. You can see a little bit more. Right in there's the gully. There's the meadow. So if you kind of look where that line of trees is, it goes clear back there. And go right over here. See, they just ripped it all up. That's just frustrating but be so worth it when it's done they left some of our trees up so if you look there's the car we're still going this is still our property so what we're thinking mom my mama's cabin probably right up in here be a good spot right off the road So quite a few trees up on this side. So up there, you'll see the fence. That is where our church is, the community church. Just up around the corner is our volunteer fire department and our community center kind of area. You can see all over. I like the look of this area over here because it's just kind of overgrown and wooded. See your flowers, our daisies. More flowers about ready to come up there. Okay, just, we're still walking. This stretch right here is the longest stretch of our property. I mean, it goes clear back there, but all this is ours. 
right up into that tree line, really. How pretty are those? Ugh. I love those. Jets flying up. Okay, so we didn't know how close this came to the edge, but we'll see right over here. So, right up there, I don't know if you can see it, it's a little orange tag. That's where we thought it ended. But actually, our stake is right here. There's our church. Cancer Road, you come down. And you cannot even see the car now. So going diagonally into there, that is our property. Come have a little bit of the tree line there. This place will be a lot of work. It'll be gorgeous when it's done. Come in some shade over here. It'll be gorgeous when it's done. It'll be super great. But man, we have a lot of work to do. I can't wait. I would be lying if I didn't say that I'm going to be a little sad to leave because I want to stay. But we don't have a cabin. I don't have a place, but here's our home away from home. See, they just ruined an area with the locking. So this is our favorite area. And get down in here. This is our little gully meadow. So this kind of goes all the way down. We don't know how deep that is, but we know it's pretty fairly deep so we'll see what we can do with that so mom's cabin will be right there you will look straight down to our meadow let me get up here you can see look at all that it goes clear down there it's so pretty down there but it does go pretty deep. Clear over there, clear up there. All right, so this whole area had quite a bit of timber in it. This is the cleanup zone. Two days of hard work of brush and moving. So here's our brush pile. That's not even a dent, a drop in the bucket here. But we cleared out all this, clear back to those trees right there, all the way over here. Oh, you can see right here too. Here's our cabin line. Here's this one. The other one's over there. Let's go this way. You can see some of our logs cut up. Two days worth of work. That's seriously not a drop in the bucket. Okay, so there's one tent pole right there. There's another one right there. 
goes over here. So this will be our area. This will be driveway. I'll look on over to this. So we own that whole area over there. You can kind of see. I will walk down in here. As you can see, they just have stuff just everywhere. Okay. Timber, all right down in there. Okay. This is the back of the cabin, so this will be our backyard. This will be the back porch here, looking up so we'll be able to see up and over. main stretch.